Hi, I'm Dr Julia Jones, Senior Lecturer in Conservation Science at Bangor University. So why should we conserve nature? Why should we set aside areas and protect them from development and not use them for growing food, all for the sake of nature? Well, one reason is simply because nature lifts the spirits. Here I am in Snowdonia National Park and the birds, the butterflies, the fascinating plants that surround me all add to the majesty and the wonder of this incredible landscape. But there are other reasons why we as society should be interested in conserving nature. And this is because society gains a whole range of benefits from functioning ecosystems. These are what we call ecosystem services. So for example, tropical forests, peat bogs, they lock up carbon in their soils and their vegetation. And that helps uh, reduce the effects of climate change that could be caused by um, transport and industry, for example. Similarly, in a sea of agriculture, leaving small patches of natural habitat, providing homes for pollinators, can provide really important pollination services for farmers, increasing the productivity of their crops. And these benefits, they really have a genuine economic value, and increasingly, ecologists who understand how ecosystems function and work are working with economists to put values on these ecosystem services, and this is starting to change the way that policymakers, governments, think about nature, they can recognise the value that, it provi that nature provides for society.